Hello and welcome to my office or the room for everything else except woodwork. <laughs> In this video I'll be spending a few hours with the Snapmaker. Uh, I know I haven't made a lot of videos with the Snapmaker but as you have seen from all my YouTube videos I have been focused elsewhere. And as I mentioned in my previous video, the Christmas demand has picked up a lot earlier than uh, last year, so I have been busy there. What I'm currently doing is having a sacrificial piece to test the settings for doing a few custom engravings uh, on my writing instruments. And that's why I love having the Snapmaker right here. I can basically finish the writing instruments, take a sacrificial piece, test my settings, and then do the engraving. Before, I had to rely on other people, and that's like taking your chances at the slot machines. I mean, you get things right, but, you know, sometimes you don't get things at all, and you have to do rework and uh, uh, give it back to them and hope the second time they, uh, they do it right. Uh, so that's why I got the machine, and that's what I'm doing for the next couple of hours. Uh, my other thing that I'm going to be doing is creating little labels for my uh, cutting boards. Basically uh, the wood, the, uh, the price tag, and as well as a few care instructions. And I plan to use the, my shop waste uh, thing that you've seen in the past uh, to do that. And not only that, the uh, shop waste will have... Uh, I shouldn't say the shop waste, the label made from the shop waste. Uh, we'll have the price tag detachable so that if you want to give it to somebody else you just simply snap off the price area and you give it to that person and the care instructions and the wooden material and whatever are still on the label so that's um, going to be my next project and maybe I'll make a video after I make the video for the resin casting or I'll do this uh, video first and then do the resin casting considering I'm at the machine right here uh, so that is uh, what's happening right now. Uh, my future plans for the Snapmaker is to basically expand it. I know they have a uh, rotating module, so that's going to be great for my writing instruments because they're round, so I can have a kind of like a wrap-up uh, design that can go around the entire writing instrument as opposed to just being on one single surface. Uh, and then probably uh, get the 10 watt module and experiment with uh, that one. So that will be in the future. So stay tuned. I mean, I promise next year I will have a lot more Snapmaker videos and a lot more how to's on, on it. Uh, the other thing is, this is my current jig for doing the engravings, which is a little bit primitive. So my other thought is to have a video on creating a jig uh, using the three different methods you know 3d print the jig laser cut it and assemble the parts and also do the cnc uh carve it out of a cnc a block of wood or a block of plywood and have it that way so that's what i'm currently thinking in my head uh, so stay tuned after the christmas rush is over this is what i'm going to be focusing on if you like this video, make sure to like, share and subscribe and hit the notification bell to get notified of my future video uploads. Also, follow me on all social media and consider supporting me on Patreon. All the links are down in the description.